It has been an emotional day across green country in the case that has many of us reeling. Right now, Tulsa police are piecing together what happened inside a home after a mother admitted to stabbing her 11 year old dozens of times and trying to set her house on fire. To hear it, Ahmad smiled as officers walked her to a police car to be booked for intent to kill. Police say the 11 year old is fighting for her life tonight. They say the eight year old was found safe and a third child managed to escape last night. We have team coverage starting with two works for you reporter Micah Hatfield live downtown with what police are calling one of the most disturbing cases they've ever seen. Micah. Good evening, Brian and Karen. To hear Ahmad admitted to police that she stabbed her 11 year old daughter more than 50 times and hit her on the head with a pickaxe. Police only know that because two women walking to lunch in this busy part of downtown spotted her SUV here in this parking lot and had the courage to call 911. Well, on Sunday was Mother's yeah. Day. I'm sure these little girls were wishing their mom happy Mother's Day and for her to do such a thing is just devastating, yeah. heartbreaking. Unimaginable moments inside a home. Ahmad admitting to police she bound and gagged her three daughters because of the way they were reading their books. The oldest bludgeoned by her mother now fighting to survive. The middle daughter escaped to a neighbor for help and the youngest, the center of an Amber Alert. And I looked at the little girl up close and I looked at Emily and I said, Emily, that's that little girl, 100%. We now know the eight year old daughter was sitting in a parking lot in downtown with her mother for 17 hours while detectives scoured the city. The two moms who called 911 say the child looked happy. Her mother lying down in the back seat. Tulsa Police Child Crisis Unit, calling this one of the worst situations they've ever seen. To have a parent stab an 11 year old little girl over and over and over and over again um, to the point of we don't know if this girl's going to live or not. Um, it's just, it's heinous. The two moms said they were just doing what any moms would do. Now we do know that the eight and nine year olds are safe. The 11 year old is still in the hospital fighting for her life in very critical condition. Ahmad was booked into the Tulsa County Jail earlier today. I'm told she's charged with assault with a dangerous weapon with intent to kill first degree arson and two counts of child neglect. Live in downtown, Mike Hatfield, two works for you.